Hey guys, take a with the video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to show you how to fix your iPhone if the callers cannot hear you on call after the iOS 17 update or it just happens to be an issue on your iPhone no matter the update that you have done. So we're going to show you how to fix this problem. So first thing is whenever you're having this issue, go ahead and pull down the control menu here. Put your phone on airplane mode briefly about a couple seconds or so and then we're going to turn it off and that does a quick network or refresh, things like cellular connect activity will get refreshed so if you're having issues with the connection it will fix that for you now after you have done that the next thing you want to do is go into your setting of your iphone and once you go into your setting of your iphone you want to go to bluetooth here and now this is important to check if you're not connected to some external bluetooth device like an airpods or another speaker or even carplay or somewhere that the audio would get routed from so i recommend is just turn off bluetooth momentarily and check to see if the audio is working and then you can turn it back on and if you have devices you can also just click on the eye icon to disconnect from them as well as sometimes they can interfere with the audio on your iPhone now after you have done that the next thing to do is if you're still having the issue is seeing if there's a carrier update for your iPhone if there is you're gonna be in your setting of your iPhone go to general and then you're gonna go to an about page so on this about page you're gonna wait about 30 seconds or so and you're gonna wait to see if there's a carrier update message that pops up so if it does pop up it's gonna look something like that where it's gonna say carrier setting update would you like to update and you click on update now again like I said wait about 30 seconds or so if there is an update it will pop up if there isn't it's not going to pop up and happens is when you do update your phone the carrier update also needs to get applied in order for the phone to be working the way it should so go ahead and wait about 30 seconds or so on the about page on your setting and if there's an update and of course go ahead and update it now after you have done that and you're still having issues it's time to go ahead and just simply do a force restart on your iPhone so in order to do a force restart there's a sequence of buttons you need to press first you're gonna press and release the volume up followed by press and release the volume down one after another quickly and then finally hold the big side button here until the screen goes completely black and you're gonna keep on holding until you see the Apple logo appear at that time you let go of that button so I'm gonna do volume up volume down and then I hold the side button here as you can see here the menu to slide to power off pops up but you do not have to well, power off that way because that will be a normal shutdown this is a force restart which we're forcing the phone to completely shut down while we're holding that button and then we let go once we see the Apple logo and what that has done is completely shut down the phone and the software and then it reloads the software so if it's a software related uh, bug glitch or anything impacting that calling feature where someone can't hear you it should fix it for you and this method is completely safe all of your personal data will still be on your phone photos videos apps documents anything that's on your phone will be there nothing will get uh, deleted now after you have done that and you're still having issues it's time to do a network reset by going to setting of your iPhone and then go to general and then go all the way down here where it says transfer reset iPhone you're gonna click on the first option to reset and the option we want to do is a network reset so when you do a network reset it takes about maybe a minute or two what it basically does is resets the settings of the network such as connected Bluetooth devices any saved Wi-Fi uh, connections all of those you have to reconnect again and any sort of connectivity around your cellular will also get you know refreshed so that if you're having issues with the connectivity causing callers not to be able to hear you it should fix it for you again this method will not delete any of your personal data so all of your photos videos apps should be fine now after you have done a network reset and it's still not working we recommend doing is a reset of all settings which is which includes all of these settings below such as the network uh, the key or the keyboard a dictionary one home screen layout and then location privacy settings and much more now these are just resetting the settings themselves so it's not going to delete any of your personal data it, everything will be fine on your phone but the settings like these that we mentioned will get reset so you'll just have to uh, connect to like a saved Wi-Fi password that you have that you need to connect to any custom home screen layout you'll have to readjust those and any location privacy settings you'll have to uh, readjust those as well but it's important to do that because if you're having that issue with callers not being able to hear you you'll need to do that now after you have done that and you're still having issues on callers not being able to hear you the next thing you want to try to troubleshoot is using 
a headphone or some connected device so that you can see if it works. So if you have an AirPods, maybe try to connect with the AirPods and see if the callers can hear you that way. Or if you have actual wired headphones, you can plug it in and see if they can hear you on the wired headphones. And if they can, that means there must be something issue with the speakers or the microphone on your phone. Sometimes what happens is if you have a phone that you uh, use a lot or have been using it for a while, these three dot ones that you see right here, these are the actual microphone that needs to be cleaned out. If there's a lot of dust or dirt buildup, it can block that microphone and in turn the callers will not be able to hear you. So if you have like something small to just wipe it down or simply use like a pick or something to remove those dust or lint, you should see a uh, improvement on the caller uh, being able to hear you. Again, it's something you want to clean out those micro phone head uh, ports. Now after you have done that, let's say it's still having issues, it's time to see if there is an update available from Apple that potentially fixes this issue. If it's an ongoing issue, you can go to setting of your iPhone, go to general, software update, and check if there's an update available. If there's an update available, of course, after you did an update, of course, there's more updates that are gonna come out. You're gonna go ahead and update your phone so that it has the latest version so if there's any bug fixes, security fixes or any glitches going on hopefully that next update does fix it for you when you do update your phone give yourself about half an hour to 45 minutes and make sure your phone is at least 50 percent or more charged in order to successfully download the update you do need to be connected to internet or a cellular data in order to download the update and successfully install it now if you have done all of that and simply the microphone what doesn't work where the caller still can't hear you it could be an issue with your cellular service in that case you'll need to reach out or contact your carrier so whatever ca company provider that you use your phone service from let them know that the callers can't hear you see if they can provide any sort of update in terms of checking the connectivity and such and they might also give you further instruction on how you can potentially resolve that issue so that's it for the video i hope now your issue is fixed and callers can actually hear you on calls if so, please hit the like and subscribe button. Also, if you found a better way to fix this problem, do let everyone know in the comment section. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys next time.